Today we will be taking you through our HDR Surface Brachytherapy module. To create a surface applicator, the user begins by selecting the appropriate module from the 3D Bolus home screen. By selecting the Browse button, the user can select the patient's directory, which houses the necessary DICOM information, including the patient's CT images and structure set coming from the Brachytherapy Treatment Planning System. The structure set must include an object for the 3D Bolus software to modify and add catheter trajectories. This applicator structure is typically increased by a margin of 2 cm in all directions around the treatment volume to ensure complete coverage. From the drop down menu, the user can select whichever structure they wish to be used as their surface applicator. For this video demonstration, I will be selecting the nose structure. This prompts the software to open a 3D render of the structure designed from the patient CT scan in order to perform the necessary modifications. By clicking the arrows in the top right corner, the user can change the direction of catheter trajectories. The orientation should be designed such that the minimum curvature is achieved. This will ensure the best probability that the radioactive source does not get jammed within the applicator structure. Within this view, the user has access to additional customizable features such as adjusting the distance between each adjacent catheter, adding or subtracting the number of trajectories, setting the distance from trajectory to the patient's surface, and determining the trajectory radius. Once the user is satisfied with the basic settings, selecting the Generate Trajectories button will prompt the software to embed the simulated trajectory locations within the applicator structure at the desired location. The user can add trajectories if they see fit by selecting the Add More Trajectories button and modify the position of individual trajectories based on the needs of the treatment. By selecting the red nodes, the user can locally adjust the shape of specific parts of the trajectory. By holding the Shift key, the user can adjust the entire trajectory in the plane normal to the patient's surface. Once the user is satisfied with all the locations, the Subtract option will prompt the software to remove the points along the trajectory line to create a hollow tunnel for the source to travel through. Post-processing can include cropping the bottom of the applicator to ensure flat adhesion to the print bed and also adding the patient ID tag, which will ensure that each printed device is being used for the correct patient. The user can then export the structure as an STL file, which is compatible with your 3D printer. The applicator can be printed in a matter of hours and does not require human intervention during the fabrication process. Once the part is complete, the user can immediately fit the applicator with afterloading catheters secured with support buttons to be used in the administration of HDR brachytherapy. With each accessory matching the contours of the patient's anatomy, therapists can sanitize and reuse each applicator for each fraction of treatment.